CBS 2 News at 5 with breaking news. A brush fire burning in Laverne. I'm Peter Dowd. And I'm Elsa Ramon. They're calling this the rodeo fire. It began on a hillside near Briny Point Road and Williams Avenue. Let's get right to Desmond Shaw above it in Sky 2. Desmond. Peter and Elsa, here we are in Laverne. I'll zoom out and uh, show you here. Yeah, not too, too far from Esperanza and Baseline. Uh, as I zoom out, though, you'll see that the situation has improved rapidly within the last hour. Uh, there were some uh, structures that are threatened here. You see some really nice estates there up on the ridge line, but they have great brush clearance that really helped them out today. Winds blowing about, uh, I'd say, 10 or 15 miles an hour to the east. Uh, but one thing that's really helping firefighters here to contain this uh, about 10 acre brush fire here is the Live Oak Canyon Reservoir that's right here. And we've had three different uh, airships that have been dipping in here. We have LA City Fire giving assistance as well as LA County Fire and the Erickson Air Crane. They're all kind of uh, up circling around right now. You can see uh, the County Fire Ship up at the top of the screen here. They're going to be coming in here. And every time something flares up here, the, the ships get in and, and they drown it right out. So they're definitely getting a handle on this fire. Uh, not really seeing too many hot spots left at this point. You see the ground crews there as well. No doubt they're going to be busy for many hours, but they've definitely turned the corner on this fire in Laverne. Live in Sky 2, I'm Desmond Shaw. Peter and Elsa, send it back to you now in the studio. Okay, Desmond, that is reassuring news, but let's go live to CBS 2's Greg Mills. He's on the ground in Laverne at this fire. Greg. And Elsa and Peter, I can update what Desmond was just saying. L.A. County Fire now says 20 acres have burned. The reason it's called Rodeo Fire is because right behind me, this is Rode, Rodeo uh, Lane. And this is at the top of that. That's where the fire started around 3 o'clock this afternoon. And it quickly burned 5, 10, 15, now 20 acres, L.A. County Fire saying. As you can see, they've been fighting this thing from the air for the last two hours. And it's kind of moved to the east. The area, Laverne is no longer in any danger is what L.A. County Fire was just telling me. Live Oak Canyon, that's the only place that's under a voluntary evacuation. And it's not an order, but suggestion, I guess. But no mandatory evacuations right now. Again, Live Oak Canyon is the only area that is uh, under uh, evacuation requests. And you can go to San Dimas uh, Regional Park or San Dimas Canyon Regional Park. Again, it's burned about 20 acres. People in this area say that this area burned. This, uh, these foothills burned in 1988-89. In fact, one woman called her relatives and said, start praying. She's a woman who lost her, fire, lost her house in the fire back in the late 80s right here. Now, we're at Baseline and Rodeo, and it's moved now into an unincorporated part of Los Angeles County. It's in the foothills, which makes it very difficult to fight from the ground, although they're trying to do that. But mostly we've seen a lot of water drops. Another one coming in right here. And you're looking right now at the one area that really is kind of still a problem area. We've seen that flare up quite a few times in like the past half hour. But again, 20 acres, a light breeze here, as Desmond said. And really, this is the only area we saw a breeze. We were coming from Pasadena, very hot here, but we didn't see any breeze, any wind until we got right here. People are out looking at this fire, but uh, nobody's home is in danger. And as Desmond said, and you probably saw from Sky too, that folks really did clear the areas around their house. I've had so many firefighters telling me right now that homes were not really in danger, somewhat in danger, but not really because uh, they had cleared so well the area around their house. And that makes a huge, huge difference when these people are trying to fight the fire and save their homes. No homes damaged, I was told by LA County Fire and no homes lost to this fire, which is great news. They're, they seem to be getting a real good handle on this, as Desmond said. Just that one area to the far right is the only real problem area, although you see some black smoke right there where you're looking. And that's about uh, maybe 400 yards uh, to the north of Baseline and Rodeo here in Laverne. But again, uh, they say that the fire has moved east of Laverne into unincorporated Los Angeles County. So things looking a little bit better. About 100 firefighters here, and they've called in for some reinforcements, expecting about 200 firefighters here by the time all is said and done. But it looks like they're doing a pretty good job. Peter, Elsa, back to you. Yes, thank